Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ4 Re, and welcome back to Myth of Empires. So I'm learning so much stuff about this game. This game is so deep. It's it's kind of incredible. All right, let me show you what I learned over here. All right, so we're gonna go to the Guild Boundary Marker, and we're gonna go to Resource Collection. And what I've learned is you can sell stuff here. See right there, I could sell rubble, 600, 600 gold. Here's the problem though. I can only sell up to 136 gold worth of stuff, I think. Okay, and the way you get that up, watch, I'll try and sell this. You need to uh, do more quests. It is exceed the amount of, in private, yeah, blah, blah, blah. You gotta, you gotta have to do quests, all right? And the quests are the daily quests. So what I did was, I did a couple daily quests and that let me sell more stuff. Um, some of these daily quests, uh, 25 elite warriors, probably not gonna happen. Eight deer, definitely not gonna happen. 205 pieces of iron. Um, yeah, I could do that and complete five daily missions. I could probably do one of these. All right, and the reason I wanted to sell stuff is because I need to make money. Now, I know what you're thinking, Cage. What? Why do you need to make money? Well, I want to make a crude planter. And I was looking in the crafting recipes everywhere for... I'm sorry. I wanted to make a better planter. <laughs> I can already make the crude planter. I've made it. It has been serving its purpose. But I need to start planting common crops. And the crude planter ain't going gonna, ain't gonna, to ain't gonna work. So I got to make the, the next planter. I forget what it's called. Something planter. <laughs> I know that much. And I couldn't find it. And apparently it's a guild tech. So there you go right there. A common planter. And I needed um, 2,900 gold to unlock this. See right here. You need 711, uh, sorry, copper coins to unlock that. You know, you're going to need a bunch of coins to unlock stuff. Which is, um, you know, pretty interesting. So I did unlock the common planter. Let's go see if we can make it right now. Um, do we make it in here? I probably should have looked. Yeah, let's look and see what it's made inside of. Common planter is made inside of the construction bench. Okie dokie. So we're going to come in here and we're going to take a look. I'm assuming... I wonder if you want to plant the... The garbage stuff. I forget what the garbage stuff is called. It's not called garbage stuff. Um, not, the, not the common, but the... Um, I mean, is it called crude? Low quality, yeah, okay. So low quality goes in the crude one, common goes in the common one. And I need to and I need to grow some common stuff because I need this coarse this coarse um uh cloth here and I need common flax for that. So we're gonna need the common planter. At least I'm assuming you need the common planter. I'd be surprised if you didn't. Uh but whatever. We're we're committed now. So we're gonna need wood ash and flagstone. Okay. So I believe we have a lot of that's not where I keep my stuff. Wood ash right here, flagstone right here. And let's make as many of these as we can. How many can we make? One. What did I run out of? Oh, planks, okay. I think I have some more planks somewhere. Um, I do not have more planks, okay. All right, well, I gotta make more planks. I make the planks in this thing, I believe. It looks like a place I'd make planks in, right? All right, branches and grass. All right, let's, I don't know why that's in there. Oh, I know why it's in there, because I'm going to use it to make the brazier. I'm trying to make the brazier. In order to make the brazier, I need coarse cloth and thick leather. Uh, so I'm also going to need a lot more wood planks. So let me make let me make a bunch of wood planks here. We're going to need um, grass now. I don't think I have a lot of grass. Somebody said I, I need to put the grass in the campfires and use that to get the ash. Oh, yeah, look at that. So is... Is grass better for ash because it burns quicker? Hmm. Possibly. Possibly. All right, let's pick this stuff really quick before we do anything else. All right, so... Oh, that's the, the rice. That's right. I'm supposed to make the rice stuff. Yeah, you can see right there I got the patties. I told you I was going to get patties. I will replant that stuff off camera. You've already seen it. Basically, if you haven't seen every video, you beat those things with a with a hoe until they... That just sounds... That sounds really bad. You beat those things with a hoe until um, their propositity, or whatever it's called, goes all the way up. And then you replant stuff, or you plant stuff. All right, so we're going to need the patties, and I think I'm going to need those for rice. Is that all I'm going to need for rice? I don't remember. Mm, yes. Okay. Going to make some rice. Should I just make a bunch of rice? Well, let's just make 17 for now. I have one more question about the rabbits, too. My rabbits, two times, have reproduced. And they're still sitting at one male and one female. Now, I've got their mood up to almost 90%. Habitat comfort is 100%. Like, what do I got to do here? Should I catch more rabbits or not? Because I'm not really sure what's going on there. And I've got some more stuff ready to go. 
Um, if their food drops or their mood drops, I'll start. I'll feed them some rabbit fodder to get that, get those numbers up. Those are rookie numbers. Gotta get those numbers up. Okay, so I need to cook rice in the clay cook bench. Okay, so I'm making rice right now, and then I think once it's made, is that all? I, oh, I need the low quality flour. That's right. I already have the edible salt. Okay, what do I need for the low quality flour? I don't remember. Low quality. Oh, whatever I have, whatever I need for it, I have it. There we go. All right, cool. Let's let all that stuff cook up, and then we're going to complete that quest. And I am also going to work on making some more common planters. Went out there and mined 200 iron. So let's go ahead and finish that daily quest. Uh, there we go. And beautiful. Okay, now can I sell more stuff for copper? And does that stuff carry over? I'm very, like, confused on how a lot of this works. Um, I'm assuming I'll, you know, get used to it over the coming weeks. But, yeah, I mean, like, I couldn't... I couldn't sell any more stuff, and I'm not really sure why. I thought it was because I needed to do more quests. When I was selling stuff off camera, it said I needed to do more quests. So right there, seven. Yeah, look at that. Unspent money, one thousand one hundred and thirty-three. Now, if I don't, if I don't do this right now and sell all this stuff, will that like change or will that just stay there? I don't think I'm gonna worry about it. I'm just gonna. Okay, it has exceeded the amount. It has exceeded the amount or value required the Imperial court today and cannot be sold. Uh, all right. I don't know why or where that was. I'm not really sure what's up with that, but um, I guess I can only sell so much per day, even if I do the quests. All right. Fair enough. Let's go ahead and grab some edible salt. We're going to need some more salt, by the way. I only have 36 edible salt. Um, that's okay. I'll probably sneak over there and grab some more salt at some point. There we go. All right. What the? Go in there. <laughs> uh, how many? How much of this stuff am I supposed to make for this quest? I don't want to make more than I need because then if it goes bad, I don't get the you know the benefits for it. Uh, so let's take a look. First meal. Oh, just one. Okay, that works for me. We're gonna need something to cook. By the way, you can't always use grass to cook with. I tried to make some flagstone over here, and grass was cooking. And there's like, if you notice when I put the grass in here, let me show you. Yeah, it's, it only has 100 heat. You need more than 100 heat to cook stuff. So I had to use sticks for this, which is totally understandable and perfectly fine. So I don't know if I'm going to need that much. Let's just grab the grass and I don't have any more sticks. <laughs> Man, I need more sticks. I got there and chopped some trees. I, I probably have a lot of sticks somewhere. Split. I'm trying. I'm going to try and cook with grass. If I can, I'll do it with sticks. Let's see. Does the food tell you how much heat you need? Um, I don't see it anywhere. So I guess we're just going to kind of give it a shot. Uh, actually, just make one. Okay. You only need grass for this one. Cool. So what, low quality rice does not go bad. Amount, weight, level. Uh, flour does not go bad. The salt does not go bad. So don't make the rice until you need it because I'm pretty sure the, ri the rice goes bad. Yes, it does. There we go. Quest finished. So now I need to make a bone spear. I don't even know if I'm specced into that, to be honest. Um, bone spear? Oh, I need to make better bows and, and arrows and stuff. Yeah, bronze arrows. You guys are telling me, uh, and a better shield. You guys are telling me when I was at that camp fighting, I need to make better ranged weapons um, if I'm going to do that kind of stuff. Okay, um, I... Don't see the bone spear anywhere. Let me uh, figure out where this is. Still waiting for those crops to get done. I want to make braziers, and I can't make braziers until I get the thick leather or the coarse whatever. And I can't do that until we get those crops done. But I could do some other quests. I went ahead and made the bone spear. I also made myself a crossbow. I don't know if I love the crossbow. I'll go shoot something in a minute, but I'm not really in love with the crossbow. If I'm going to be perfectly honest with you guys. We already did that one. Cool. So let's go ahead and put the spear in here. I'm not, I don't love the spears in this game. Um, some of the quests I have is to do stone foundations. So I'm going to be working on that. I need brick and square wooden boards. The brick is being made in here. Brick is stone and flagstone. All right. And then let's see those square boards. Mm, okay. All right. That's very, very doable. Let's get some hardwood. 
get those square boards going. There's like so much stuff to do. You know, you come in thinking you're going to do one thing and you get like, you know, I'm not even going to say sidetracked. You kind of pushed into a different area, <laughs> basically. All right, let's go ahead and eat that. There we go. Then we got some kind of buff. Look at that food bar go up. I didn't look at the buff. <laughs> what does it do? Increases max stamina by 10 points for 30 minutes. All right, you know, not bad. Nothing to write home about, but I'm, you know, extra stamina is always good. Right, so let's go and make some of that. Uh, just remember, if you're going to make the crossbow, you need to make bolts and not arrows. Just remember, just remember that. Um, do I want to go out and shoot something now? Now nah, let's, let's do some more. Let's do some more crafting in here. I'm going to go ahead and make this. I got to make the gate frame, the gate and two fort walls. Gate frame, the gate and two of the fort walls. If that's a fort wall, what is this? Oh, barbed wooden fort wall. Okay. All right. Very good. Forge a hand sword mold. I don't know what, I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. <laughs> I have to look into that. In the meantime, let's come in here. Grab these. Put them in here. I gotta make four of these. Uh, yeah, that's not gonna happen. Well, do I have any more stone? It's hard to get like regular stone. Like the pebbles are, you know, pretty easy. Regular stone, yeah, not so much. Okay. That should be enough though. Got to throw these in here. Um, yeah, let's just make six more. It sucks it's going to use up all my regular stone, but... All right, X, because that's finished. All right, and let's just put these away, because I'm not going to be building with these right now. Awesome. Uh, let's go out and shoot something. I feel like shooting something. Let's find something to... Let's find something to shoot. Come on, buddy. I got to take this guy out for a ride. I do not take him out enough. Oh yeah, by the way, I made a um, I made a new uh, shield. You can see it on my back. It's like a tower bone shield type thing. I don't know if it's any good, but I was like, yeah, it looks it looks impressive. It def definitely looks impressive. Now, I'm not looking for any kind of crazy fight. But you know what? Maybe I am looking for a crazy fight. Yeah, you know what? To hell with that. Not looking for a crazy fight stuff. Let's go fight over here. There we go. We're going to go fight some people. So, if I remember correctly, you could take over farms or fields or whatever. And then, like, just have... I think you can, like, capture people and then, like, set up a, a farm that will take care of itself. I don't know if... I, I don't know if I'm at that point yet. I don't know when I should do that. But I'm going to go over there and just see what level they are. I think I passed by them a few times and they seem pretty low level. So, we're just going to kind of see what's what. All right. You stop. Get off them. Stay there, buddy. I gotta try my new crossbow. You can't even, like, aim with it. If I right-click, I can't, like, aim with the thing. It's kind of weird. Yeah, there's a lot of guys there. Alright, yeah. Wh why can't I aim ahead of time? Like, at least, I don't even... You know what? Let's just go first. Yeah, I don't even have a cross... I don't even have a reticle anymore. Oh, because I gotta load it. There we go. Yeah, this thing sucks. Why can't I aim it beforehand? <laughs> right? <laughs> Why do I gotta wait until I'm shooting to aim it? I'm, I'm probably just gonna go back to the bow. Got him now. Damn, 156 damage. I like that. Alright, here we go. Block. I didn't even shield out. Ooh. Block, 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 block. Oh, he blocked me. He blocked that. So if he's blocking on one side, I think you want to come in on the other side. Although he kind of messed with his block there. I guess I could jab him. Oh. Damn. There we go. Guy's got way too much health. Nice. Got him. <laughs> he is not happy. So I like the damage on it. I'm not gonna lie. Ooh, money. Money, money, money. I do like the damage on it, but 
I just don't, I want to be able to just aim it at before I go to shoot it. Maybe there is a way to aim it. I'm just not sure. I don't know. We're gonna kill the. We're gonna kill the um, people with weapons, not the farmers. Although the farmers look like they have weapons on their back. Okay. That out. Take that out. Jab slash. Oh, I want to show you something about my weapons. It kind of, kind of sucks. Yeah, I'll show you in a minute. Okay. It looks like I'm hitting with my shield. If I don't take my shield down all the way before I go to hit, it looks like I'm doing like a shield bash. One thing's for sure, man. Like, I'm not doing enough damage to them. That's pretty good. But still, look at how many hit points they have. And I'm way higher than this person. I should be slaughtering them. Oh yeah, you see that one where you come down? Where I like start up and I come right down in their head? That looks pretty good. Okay, so check this out. Someone brought this to my attention. In this game, you have a one-handed skill, right? And if your one-handed skill is too low, guess what? Your weapon doesn't do its full damage. So because my one-handed skill is not up to snuff, um, I'm getting, if you look at the bottom of that skill, insufficient skill level penalty, negative 8.6%. Now, that doesn't sound like a huge difference, so like I guess I'm not going to worry about it for today, but yeah, people are telling me, like, People have been playing this game for a while. They're like, the single player is horribly imbalanced, and I hope they kind of look into that. Um, but we'll see. I feel like I should, you know what? I'm going to go back and get our bow. I want to use the bow. All right, nighttime is going to be here relatively soon. But let's go ahead and mess around with the bow a little bit. We got um, the new bow, and we've also got um, better arrows. So let's see how this goes. All right. Okay, no good there. No good there. Not doing this much that much better with this one. There we go. Alright, 56 damage. <laughs> I don't know where that was going. 32 damage. Ow. Okay. Time for me to work on my one-handed skill. Make a lot more bandages, by the way. A lot more bandages. Damn it! Oh, I like. See, I like that hit. I'm just not sure how I do it. There we go. Got it. Vagrant hostility. Whatever, bro. Whatever. Let me go ahead and heal up. And you know. Maybe the crossbow is better. I only get one shot off, but I'd probably do more damage with that one shot than I do with the two or three shots. Well, I think I'd need three shots with the bow to make it worth it. But if people are going to be throwing stuff at me, then, you know, not really going to work. Oh, nice shot, Cage. See, the fact that they can be ranged as well Makes this, like, not really feasible. Oops. Plus, my arrows are expensive. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, the, the fact that they're coming and throwing stuff at me makes this not really... It's not going to work. I think the crossbow might be the way to go. Yeah, that's the one I like. Ah! Trying to hit him in the head. Doesn't seem to be doing that much to him there. Yeah, it's okay. I gotta get better at one-handed. That's what it is. Oh, come on, had they not hit him? Screw it. Enough of this fucking defense crap. Enough I says. Yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know. The fact that they that they can range me back just makes the, the, the bow not really working for me. 
You know, because they're just going to get close enough and I got to take out my shield or I'm just going to get hit too. If I'm getting hit too, the boat, is, the boat isn't, it's not, doesn't do anything. You know? All right, so let's see. Where's this level 23? Are you sitting at a fire? Yeah, you are. Okay. I'm going to put one right in your dome. Yep, see? There he goes. He's taking out his ranged weapon. Yep, and I'm getting hit too. What? Block. You know, I, I'm going to be honest with you guys. Consider I'm hitting them right in the head with a sword. I feel like they're kind of living through a lot of it. <laughs> that they shouldn't be. Come on. Whatever. Come on, you piece of crap. There you go. That's what you get. Oh, let's go ahead and eat. Eat a bunch of stuff. Come on, eat more. Eat more. Okay. All right, it is getting a little dark. I think I've made my point here. What that point is, I do not know, but I think I'm going to bail out. Um, so far, from that very limited combat experience, I think the crossbow is the way to go. You do that one shot, and if you hit him, good. And if you don't, you try again until you hit him. But um, using the bow is not really going to do much for me when they can range me back. So that's just my thought process. You guys cool. let me know what you think. So I planted low quality flax seeds, got some low quality flax. When I was harvesting the low quality flax, I got common quality flax seeds. The common quality flax seeds are what I need. So we're gonna go ahead and I'm waiting for more um, grow plots planters to be made. I need the common quality planters. I'm waiting for them to be made uh, so I can do more with the um, you know common flax seeds. And in the meantime, I'm gonna go ahead and just do some building out here. I would like to try and get some foxes at some point. Eat. There we go. And we'll just kind of see how that goes. I'm going to need this. Six. Get rid of that. Back to this. Eat. Good. Can't put it there. Let's put one right here. Nah, let's put it right there. See what that does for us. Yep. That's looking good. Yes. Gotta start thinking what I'm gonna put in the front. I guess I'll put the... I don't know what I'm gonna put in the front. I'm probably gonna start moving some stuff outside. Um, although, you can't pick up the freaking... You can't pick up the, the crafting station. So if you move a crafting station outside, I'll lose, I think, half of it. And then I have to build it again outside. It's kind of annoying. But it is what it is. Nothing can be done about that now. I'm committed. Let's go ahead and put down the fox thing. We're not gonna go catch a fox today. But I might as well put it down because I did make it. I made it a while ago. I made it before the rabbit one. Alright, there we go. That right there. Let's go outside and see what we can do with this thing. And by what I can do with this thing, I mean just put it down. Alright, seven. So, alright, so we need to go on the outside just like we did with the rabbit thing. Alright, and we're gonna have to jump down. And just kind of line it up, I guess, as best we can. Lined up. That's lined up right about there. But I think it's not lined up anymore. It's kind of hard to tell. But I wanted to line it up properly. Yeah, I think I did a pretty good job with that. Okay, so... Animal farm. It's if for foxes. Can animal farms hold anything? I, I specifically made this for foxes. It's kind of weird. It's almost like I, put, I could put anything in it. Maybe, um, maybe foxes and boars? Might share the same. I, that was specifically a, a, a fox pen. Like, what the hell? <laughs> it's kind of weird. Um, yeah, I can only make two pens. One is for rabbits, one is for foxes. I, I don't know. I guess it really doesn't matter. All right, let's grab that. And we're only going to need two of those for the time being. So that's good. So I'm going to come out here and we're going to do some... i got to figure out where I want to put these farms. See, I don't have a lot of room out here. I guess I could put these farms over here. The thing is, am I going to need these farms again? Like these crude ones? Maybe I could put them down right here. 
Oh, goodness, they're big. Okay, you know what I'm going to have to do? We're going to have to make some more foundations. i got to expand. Yeah, there we go. Looking pretty good here. Nice little farm. Like it. Uh, let's go ahead and plant this stuff. Can I plant more than... Oh, you can plant nine per... Oh, I didn't even realize that. Here's the, here's the thing I want to know, though. Can I can I plant low-quality stuff there? And is it better to plant low-quality stuff there? I hope so. I don't want to have, like, a bunch of different kinds of, you know, um, crops everywhere. It's kind of annoying. Um, should we do some common wheat seeds? Common soybean? I don't need them right, right now, right this minute. I think, uh, what do I need? Wheats? Yeah, let's do some wheat. Low-quality wheat. Let's do some low-quality rice. Some low quality soybean. And I think that'll work out pretty good. And we're just going to kind of plant these low quality things in there. I mean, maybe they won't let me. I don't know. We're going to find out. Five. Okay, cool. There we go. And then I go to six. There. And go to seven. See, some games would be tempted to have you do different grow plots for different, you know, um, for different plants. And that just sucks. That sucks. Like, I don't want to do that. I want to have one, I want to have one thing of plots. Once these are like good and I know they're good, I'm going to make more of these. I'm going to get rid of these. That's, that's what I'm thinking. Uh, we do need a well. Um, where, where is the well? Am I, am I close to the well? Irrigation. Oh, yeah, I could get it right now. All right, cool. Let's do that. All right, so what do we need for the well? I probably should have looked. Uh, well, uh, construction bench, hardwood, copper, twine, clay, flagstone. I have all that, and I will get it together, and it's going to be the first thing we do next episode. Unless I forget, and I very well might, but I'll try not to. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. Uh, thank you very much. That's not how the outro goes, Cage. Why you mess up your archo cage? I don't know. Who cares, man? This game's fun. If you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.